hello. Oh, don't be shy. Come say hello. Nadal. Are you tired? Okay. Just put your back. Oh, okay. Hello. everyone hope you're all okay Chris is currently busy uploading some of our new products to our Etsy page which we hadn't been uploading for quite a while um, they have got a bit of a bad reputation at the minute there's lots of complaints coming from people um, that they've been closing pages down removing products for no reason um, doing both and not giving reasons for these things um, but we had a good chat yesterday um, and thinking as part of our sort of marketing campaign that we were going to give Etsy another go. Um, it's probably worse for those small businesses that heavily rely on Etsy or only rely on Etsy, whereas a lot of our business does come through our Facebook page and comes through our website. So absolutely worst case, if something did happen with Etsy, we still could carry on trading and um, so Chris is on that at the moment. Today I'm going to be working on our reasons why I love you jars ready for Valentine's Day so I'm going to take you from the very very beginning of our blank jars and the actual finished product and then at the end of this video we're going to show you all of our Valentine's range that will be ready to be uploaded in the shop so you guys will get a sort of sneaky peek before that goes live so let's get going <music>
a good start on the Etsy relaunch upon uploading the products, we get this message. Etsy, you wonder why you've got bad reviews. <laughs> So after further investigation uh, from the message we received in Etsy messages, they then sent through uh, a link, which again didn't look right to me. So I did a bit of digging into Etsy's terms and conditions and their sort of frequently asked questions. And what it says is that any emails that come from Etsy will be in the from Etsy inbox specifically, which as you can see, there are no conversations so it turns out it was just a scam, uh, but yeah, don't get caught out. So this is where it says here, so we've got authentic Etsy messages from our employees always appear in a from Etsy inbox. So yeah, be vigilant if you're setting up an Etsy store and watch out for these messages. Shocking. So first attempt on the uh, reasons why I love you jars didn't go very well. Not gonna lie, had a bit of a ten temper tantrum about it. Um, what I've done is I changed the font. I think because it's not huge, um, sometimes Cricut struggles to cut really, really small fonts. So round two, I've made the font a bit bigger, a bit chunkier, and we'll see how that one goes. And um, well, let's see. <laughs>
Okay, so the jar is done. I'm happy with that. The hearts are done. I ended up doing two colours um, in the end because I felt like we needed a bit of a bit of a contrast. Um, but I think they look really pretty. So I'm thinking potentially ten of each colour. Hopefully that'll be enough. Um, we'll see what it looks like and maybe regroup. But get some things down on here and we'll get these photographed ready for the site. <laughs> Okay, so our Valentine's range is finally complete. So we've got our dig cute Cupid card we've got over here. We've obviously got Hearty and Heartette, our lovely couple. Our personalised jigsaws. How cute are those people? Yeah. And we've got then our Hearty and Heartette die cut stickers there. Our personalised reasons why I love you jars. A lobster card, our button cards, and lastly, our bookmarks. So they're going to be available in our shop very, very soon. By the time this video goes out, they will all be there, ready and raring to go for you. Happy Valentine's! <laughs>